Hello everyone, welcome back to the Tech Super channel. Today in this video, we are going to look at what are the various ways to download connectivity agent. As you might be knowing what is connectivity agent, a connectivity agent is nothing, it is just like a simple installer which allows you to make a connectivity between OIC and on premises application. So before you install connectivity agent, you may have to, you need to download the connectivity agent. Now in this video, I will show you what are the different ways to download connectivity agent. Okay, so guys, before we start, I will ask everyone to subscribe my channel to get regular updates of my YouTube channel. One more useful information, if you are willing to learn Oracle Visual Builder in with real-time scenarios, I have authored a book on Oracle Visual Builder, which is this, which is published recently, and the publisher is fact. So this is the good big good book which you can buy and start learning the Oracle Visual Builder. So if you are willing to buy, you can simply go to this link https colon slash slash fact dot live slash 3mw snrc, which will take you to the Amazon website from where you can buy ebook as well as the hard copy of the book. Okay. So there are various options using which you can download the connectivity agent. So let's suppose you, you are the service administrator and you have the access of the console. So it is one of the simplest way to download the connectivity agent. You need to log in into Oracle integration console. You navigate to the integrations and integration and go to the agent. From there, you will see the download option from the top right corner of the page and if you click on this download it will show you the connectivity agent option and once you start once you will click on this it will start downloading the connectivity agent and it is a very lightweight setup like 152 mb setup and will be downloaded as per your internet speed so this is most easy and convenient way to download and once it is downloaded you can transfer it to the host machine where you want to install the connectivity agent. The another option is using Postman and similar tools. Okay, like the client tool, if you are willing, if you have Postman and you think you need to download it via the Postman. Okay, so there's a unique URL called HTTPS colon slash slash the OIC URL, then slash IC slash API slash integration slash v1 slash agents slash binaries slash connectivity. So this is the endpoint or we can say URL, which will allow you to download the agent via Postman and similar tools. So here you need to add the basic authentication. The user should be the IDCS user. You can enter the username and password. And when you click on this and you see the small uh, arrow here, click on this and click on a send and download and it will download a file response.zip which you can save it which you can save it in your folder wherever you want you can rename it as well so this is the second option and then once it is downloaded then again you can transfer it to the host machine and then install it this option is the another option let's suppose uh, you are installing the agent on the Linux machine and you don't have an interface access okay, of the Linux so that you can transfer it. So the curl is the beautiful command which allows you to download. So curl is the Linux based command which can be used to download anything okay, from the internet. But make sure on that machine you must have the internet. Okay, So curl space hyphen x then the get this is the get and then https the complete URL and then, as I mentioned, it's like uh, you are downloading from the postman. You need to add the basic authentication using the header, hyphen H, authorization basic. And here you need to add base64 encode of username and then password, hyphen O. And that will be the path wherein you want to keep the connectivity agent. So it's, these are the three options using which you can download connectivity agent. So this option, the third option will be useful if you don't have access of the machine means the interface access where you can transfer from your local machine to host machine. Now, let me just take you to the OIC console wherein I will show you how to download it. Okay. Right. So here 
I have logged in into my OIC console from here. You can click on this hamburger menu and click on integration and go to the agents as I have shown you. From here, it's very simple. You can click on this download and simply click on this connectivity agent option. Once you will click on it, it will start downloading. I'm not downloading it because I already have it. This is the first way. The another way to download the connectivity agent via the postman, okay? Let me just open the postman and we'll show you that as well. So this is my postman here, okay? And here you see, I have added the complete URL like OIC dev zero. This is my OIC instance URL and then slash IC slash API integration slash V1 agent binaries and connectivity. And here you can add the authorization. It's a get basic authentication name is Ankur and then password. And then once you click here and click on a send download, what it will do, it will kick off the a command and it will download. So once it is downloaded, it will give you a prom prompt wherein you can save the file. So let it happen. I will show you. So here you can see it's response. You can say it's a zip file. You can save it as a zip file wherever you want, or you can rename it. Okay. So this is the second way. I'm just canceling it. Now let me just take you to the terminal window, means the Linux box. And you can download it here. So my current directory is this one, slash home press OPC new agent. This is my Linux machine. And you can see as of now, I don't have anything here. Okay. Nothing. So let me just take the curl command, which I will paste it here and will show you how to download it. Okay. Like this. So the same command curl hyphen X get, and this is the URL. I can give you this URL in the description of this video and then hyphen H authorization basic. So this is basic authentication hyphen O and this is the path means the current path and then simply say enter. Okay, it will start downloading and you see D load speed and depending on your speed, you will be able to download. And you see OIC hyphen connectivity hyphen dot agent dot zip has been downloaded. So this is the way to download connectivity agent. Right. So guys, that's all about this short video. If you have any question, you can comment. I will be happy to assist you. And you can find me over LinkedIn, you can find me over Twitter, you can find me on Facebook, you can see my blog https colon slash slash www.taxata.com and please don't forget to subscribe my channel to get regular updates. Thank you for watching the video. Have a good day. Bye.